<coughs> so, um, I'm at Callum Park here again before everyone else. I guess I'm just an early bird. I don't know if I'll actually post this video or not. Um, and I'm walking the tracks and uh, seeing if I, seeing if there's uh, anything that needs to be uh, taken out. Like that thing right there. And got my coat here. Just in case, because it's pretty foggy. It's not really raining, but it is pretty foggy. So, uh, I kinda... Last time... <clears> the <throat> uh, Sorry, I, I seem to have developed a bit of a cough, and that's made my throat pretty, uh... Gross. Did I miss anything? No. Okay. Um... Uh, last time... I learned, um, the difference between a leading truck and a trailing truck. You guys want to know what that is? No? Well, too bad. Um, so a trailing truck is the truck, which is the thing that holds the wheels, is the truck in the back, and the leading truck is the truck in the front, obviously. And then there's the leading wheel and the trailing wheel, which go... They apply to the same principle. So, in total, there's a leading truck. Uh, there's a leading wheel on the leading truck. A le uh, trailing wheel on a leading truck. A leading wheel on a trailing truck. And a trailing wheel on a trailing truck. If I said that all correctly. That's the thing. Here's a tree. It's blocking my path. Oh, no. Tree. Isn't too much. A bunch of leaves have fallen, but not really on the track, surprisingly. I saw, I saw a couple of leaves that looked like they'd been ran over, but... Well, that can't be, because engine's out running yet. So that's pretty weird. Here's like a yard. It's not really a yard, it's more like a... Here's, in some cases, we store extra engines here. Um, <coughs> there's a guy. In some cases, when like we're extra busy, or we think we're gonna be extra busy, we have um, another engine sitting right on that siding. And if we need to, we can pull it out real fast. Well, I've only seen us do it once, but I haven't been here too long. I mean, I've been here long enough to learn how to drive the train, and that's pretty cool. Ooh. I'm kind of dizzy. Um. In fact, we had a head-on collision. Well, we almost had a head-on collision at those points right there. Because of, like, that reason. Well, that was cool. Okay, bye. <coughs> this is really cool. Got it a little bit above, so you're perfect. Perfect. That's awesome. And then this is a hand car. A little hard to do this with one hand.
Looks like I'm not the only one with a camera. <laughs> Hi, Joe. I'm thinking I'd take a video. This is really cool. Hi. I'm going up a hill. Yeah. This is probably dangerous. I'm probably... Now I'm going, starting to go. Oh, wait. I'm going up the hill. I can't wait to go down the hill. Because then I probably won't even, I probably won't even have to use the push cart feature. You can probably just let it. <coughs> As I was saying before, I was so rudely interrupted. I can probably... Okay, I'm gonna... I'm charging at the hill here. I'm going to the tunnel. This is a lot harder than it looks. Hope I don't run into anyone. I might just use my feet here. Oh, I forgot I got a whistle. I have a whistle in my mouth. Oh, I started to roll back down. Right. Here we go. Into the tunnel. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Yay, we've done it, boys. We've done it. What? the hill and we can just coast ourselves down. I'm not sure how fast we go though. Not yet, here we go. I better keep a hand on the thing just in case I need to break. putting any force on it, I'm just letting my hand, you know. Maybe I'll put a little force because there's another small hill. I'm gonna have to get up that. Here we go. Cars. There 
is um, an 060 engine, tank engine. I think that's what Rosie actually started. That's a Shea. Gotta make sure that I'm not in anyone's way. Yeah. I'm kinda tired. Let me just stop here for a second. Stupid idea. Well, oh, okay, that was a bad idea. Oh shit. I mean, shoot, I'm sorry, I really didn't mean to say that. But there's an engine behind me and I gotta get going. Or else I'm gonna get ran into. In fact, I might just let you guys go. Bye. Hmm. That's cool. Boy, I'm doing all sorts of things today, because now, now I'm in Plumco. This is the maintenance work. This is the maintenance diesel. It's electric, which um, means it's not as powerful. It's more designed for speed. And since it's not as powerful, we only use it for maintenance, I think. Here's the controller. This one's a lot simpler. That's really loud. There, that little pulley right there, that's the bell. But I gotta keep going, because... There's another, there's another engine on the track. This might take a little getting used to it. The controls are a lot different. It's a lot touchier. I'm trying, I'm... Pay attention to your driving. Alrighty. Watch out for the train behind you. I know, I, that's why I'm... I got a head start. Thank you, though. Friggin' I know what I'm doing. But I probably should stop filming. Bye. I'm an old, bumpy, abandoned section of track that I'm not supposed to be in. No, I'm just kidding. I'm on the main line. I mean, the others don't see me. So that's cool. 
But I just figured I, guys, I should show you guys the tunnel with the plum boat. Hold on there, pal. I'm not fly shunting. Oh, well, no wonder. This is how a lot of old shunters lost their fingers, you know. There we go. Oh, Oak didn't take a picture of that. See ya. Thank you. No problem. That's a beautiful engine. And right after it, here comes another beautiful engine. Good thing today is a slow day. <coughs> Wine just, wine that just super cool. I guess I might as well take a picture of them too. That's Larry on that one. The one who's driving the Shay is um Mike. Hi, Larry. Now I'm going to activate the turntable. Oh yeah. Bring it up a little. <coughs> it's a lot heavier than it looks. That should be good.
Here we go, that's where I should be. Okay. Well, that was fun.